PC alignment. Before starting the alignment, use a leveler to make sure that the pole is 100% vertical. You need to check both sides of the pole at 90 degrees separation. This is a critical step in any link. Make sure to properly close and tighten the covers of the ports that are not in use. Connect the cables to the ports. Connect the glands to the ports, making sure to tighten the first part firmly by hand and only after to tighten the cap firmly by hand. Connect the multimeter to the RSL VNC connector and set the multimeter to VDC. Loosen the two bolts and two nuts to start alignment of the antenna from left to right. You will see that the reading on the multimeter is changing. Go all the way to the right, then slowly go all the way to the left while looking at the reading on the multimeter. Find the highest reading while going left. You read the received signal level by converting the voltage after dot on the multimeter to a negative value. So 1.99 volts becomes minus 99 decibels and 1.43 volts becomes minus 43 decibels received signal. The lower the voltage, the better the reception level, meaning that a received signal of minus 40 decibels is much better than minus 90 decibels. The result depends on the link budget. Move the antenna back to the right until you reach the highest result so far. Tighten the nuts so the antenna stays at this direction and loosen the bolts for the elevation alignment. Turn the bolt that changes the antenna's vertical angle until the antenna goes all the way down. Turn the bolt to the other direction all the way and check for the highest result on the way. Once you have reached the maximum angle, turn the bolt back until you return to the best result that you saw. Now start the fine tuning by releasing one of the two nuts and move the antenna slowly until you see improvement. If you do not see any improvement, close back the nut all the way and open the other one and move the antenna slowly to the other direction until you see improvement. Once you reach the best result, re-tighten the nut. Now turn the bolt of elevation slowly until you see improvement. If you do not see any improvement, turn the bolt in the other direction until you get the best result. Tighten all the bolts and nuts. Look at the multimeter while tightening so that there is no movement in the antenna and change in the result. Put tie wraps on each gland. 